Hey everyone, welcome to your Medical Minute segment with Colorado Springs Orthopedic Group. Today we're talking to Dr. Paul Stanton about the sacroiliac Sacroiliac, joint. you got it, perfect. Oh my gosh, alright, that is so hard to say, but you're actually going to kind of tell us what exactly that joint is. I've never heard of it before. So the sacroiliac joint, or SI joint, we can say SI, it's just SI. easier to work through. Way easier. So that's the joint that links the spine and the pelvis. So it's okay. not the hip, it's not the back, it's between those two things. Okay, so it's in between the hip and the back. Yes. All right, so I have hip pain quite often. So how do I know if my pain is coming from the SI joint or maybe something else? So typical patients have had their lumbar spine evaluated and it's not been found that their pain is coming from that area. Okay. So we start to work up the sacroiliac joint through physical examination, history, some imaging, and most important, some diagnostic injections. Okay, so how do you then move forward and actually diagnose this SI uh, joint dysfunction? So successful injections with a good response, uh, appropriate imaging, okay. and we find that patients have good response to those, to those items. Um, it lets us know that they're a good candidate for treatment. Okay, so what are those treatment options then once you move forward? So fairly typical, the options are the same. You know, do nothing. You don't have to have treatment for that problem. Yeah. Uh, physical therapy, injections, pain management, manipulation, all work very well. If those things fail and are not providing long-lasting relief, sometimes surgery can be a good option for that joint. Okay, that's always the last resort. We're going to try a lot of those other things first sure. and see if those work for us. Always try the easy stuff and move on from there. Okay, so... When should we decide to then go to a specialist and kind of check this stuff out? The SI joint is pretty difficult to diagnose, and we find that just people don't have a good knowledge base of how to kind of figure out what joint is giving them trouble, if it's the, the hip or the back or the SI mm -hmm. joint. So that is an area where if you're frustrated and just not getting the results from some other diagnoses, it may be worthwhile to get a, a visit with a practitioner that specializes in SI joint mm -hmm. a little earlier rather than later. And then they can help to custom tailor a program of diagnosis and treatment. Perfect. There's lots of options here, so we should never feel like, you know, we're lost and we don't know what to do. So Come and ask for some help. We're glad to figure it out. Perfect. Thank you so much for talking with me today. Absolutely. Thanks for having me. Perfect. And you can find more information about Colorado Springs Orthopedic Group online at csog.net.